I think Thomas was very dissatisfied with mediocrity. Anywhere things are still happening the way they've always happened, Thomas had lots of questions about that. Thomas had a, had a, had a knack for asking hard questions and make them not as hard to talk about, but really have solutions in mind afterwards too. I, I'm actually a better father now, a better stepfather, a better husband, a better friend, a better leader because of Thomas. In order to have action, you have to have courage. He was a courageous person, ready to ask questions, ready to dig a little bit deeper, even where you're like, that's, that's a little bit too deep, Thomas. He's like, no, it's not too deep. Us digging this deep, is going to give us the results that we're wanting. When I struggled with, you know, where I should be or what I should be doing in the community, it challenged me to, to see that I had a space at the Kansas Leadership Center and that I belonged there. And he really challenged us to think differently, but in a respectful way, um, because he really understood what our young professionals group was about. What's really going on in the minds of a lot of younger professionals is, you know, I'm just trying to figure out how to fit in. What made Thomas stand out is he thought it was silly to wait. And his willingness to do that, it didn't lead him to fitting in, but it led him to standing out.